in the end, of course, we hope that in this project, we can find novel treatment strategies. For that purpose, we need to identify what's going wrong in the brain and what's, what particular biological substrates are affected. So for that reason, we use all kinds of brain imaging techniques to see whether maybe some certain cell properties or maybe their connections are being altered uh, in these different patient groups. So for that purpose, we use brain imaging in patients, but of course we can use the animal tissue to have a more closer look at what's ongoing in the brain. For example, are there rearrangements in the way that the synapses are being formed? Or is there something wrong with the way that particular brain cells are being connected with each other? For that purpose, we can use all kinds of staining techniques to find out if there is a particular circuit affected more in high social withdrawal than, for example, in low social withdrawal individuals, and use that knowledge then to functionally validate those circuits in relation to these phenotypes.